Mm -hmm. So hello everybody. Of course, um, I bought the extra lineman and get matched up 220 TV down against Necro as a result. Um, you know, who knows if I hadn't bought those two players, maybe I wouldn't have got matched up against them. He spent his money instantly for a Bloodweiser babe. So I don't know if he if he knows who I am. What's he got? A Blodge Guard fleshy. No tackle on my team. Thankfully, no dodge on his werewolves. Two Blodge Guard ghouls. Brutal. So he's got four guard. Um, Twelve players. Wow. And then I did go for the extra two linos here. Because I thought build up to 12 players. Maybe a troll as well as the 12th. Um, just a couple of guard. A pommer. Pommer's obviously pretty shit against uh, Necro because they can regen. So, um, I've got 220. I could go with the troll rather than the wizard. Not this troll. This troll. Um, I guess the wizard's the only way I'm going to bring down his, his bludge ball carrier, but Ripper would really... It's gonna be higher. He's got no. He's got the guard. He could get two dice, two dice, two dice on him. So let's go for the wizard. And um, and see if I could get a merc troll with guard. I would do that. Um, I guess get a apo to um, keep the players up against him, against the double claw. So, yeah, you know, maybe I shouldn't have bought those two players. They might have got matched against somebody else if I hadn't bought them. That, that's why I that's why I don't want to buy the players. Not to exploit the matchmaking to get an advantage. It's just to exploit the matchmaking to not get completely screwed like this. I mean, this isn't completely screwed, but it's annoying, isn't it, being 220 TV down? It's not ideal. I'd rather not. Like, even though I get a wizard, I'd rather not. I'd rather have a fair game without a wizard than have a wizard. Just went straight for a baby. Yeah, he got it instantly, didn't he? Don't try to please everyone. I'm going to BM you so hard. I'm not trying to please everyone, Fashbinder, but I just thought, you know, I don't know. A genuine asshole. Why do you want to be Mr. Nice? <laughs> All right, fair enough then, Morgans. Um, yeah, fair enough, Fashbinder. Uh, oh, I don't know. Vara Gulchua, yeah. Yeah, if he had tackle, then I would have done. Um, yeah, 18, 1900 ish. When, you, when you've when you got, like, you know, when, you, when you're coming up against Clop on a regular basic basis, basically. Um, regular basis, this is, this is, regular basis. When you're coming up against Clop on a regular basis, then it's the time to. Um, to do it, isn't it? Right, so he's got a he's got a little shithead zombie here. He's gonna get tagged by uh Black Orc. And then this guy probably wants to get claw pom claw pom pond. Guard's gonna have to go in there. Something like this, maybe. More heavies on this side. Um, BLGF, which means uh, best of luck and uh, great fun. <laughs> <laughs> nice guy. Nice guy, Jimmy, there. Um, just, being, just being a lovely person, really. Um, that's what I bring to Blood Bowl. 
Yeah, he really should have tackled with that Baragul too, shouldn't he? Yeah, so if you go 12 players, yeah, 12 players when you buy the fourth player first, which, yeah, that's fair enough. Um, that's the ball over there. That's a bit of a fucking bastard, isn't it, with this, this shithead, um... Werewolf here. Fuck. <laughs> Can't even nice guy, right? Um okay, so he 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 has to block him first. Okay. So that he can he can tag him. And they can they can stop this guy coming straight through. Um, Powers is blodger. Brilliant. Injury. Oh, I'm so lucky. Just failed. Oh no, there was no animation. Oh, but it was both down. No, it wasn't both down. Fuck. Don't know why I thought it was both down. Fuck. Oh, that would have been that would have been epic for no regen. That would have been a fucking epic no regen, wouldn't it? Um, so I've got to think about if it's a both down. I'd rather be in front like this. I guess I gotta hope I don't ca don't cas him straight off. KO. <sighs> Give up a fucking frenzy claw hit. Oh shit. Cause he can run through and pressure the ball, so I'm gonna have to. So maybe I should have picked up the ball first. And he's he's, bl he's blocking me into a foul as well. Genuine asshole, even the missus knows. <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah. <Dang. laughs> yeah, dodge back if you want to fall over. Yeah, exactly, Grave Master. I probably did want to fall over, to be honest. Because now I'm going to get knocked over. Yeah, I know that. No, I'm too. I just wanted to pile on to um, not get punched by a uh, punched by a wolf. I should have gone for the pickup first so that I could have failed the dodge and not get eaten by claw. But it looks like he's going to push him in a in a not a good. Oh, I can surf him if I had Juggernaut and Frenzy, but then he wouldn't have done it. <laughs> No, yeah, he gets to blitz. He gets to blitz my guarder. Shit. With claw. Mm hmm. Killed. Aha, fuck you, you've got no block. Hmm. At least it, it burned. It burned a reroll for him. Oh wow! And he's he's just giving up a he's giving up a two dice block and his dog as well. So that worked out actually all right, didn't it? That actually worked out all right. Wow! One dice pow. It's going to be tough to protect the ball here. 
Very tough. This this formation and not get served and stop the breakthrough has actually completely screwed me, hasn't it? Two GFIs. Why is that one dice on? Duh. <laughs> Why is that one dice? <laughs> Fucking hell. I have to make some dodges here to protect the ball. GFIs and dodges. Two GFIs and then a dodge out. I mean, I guess I could move this guy to here. And then get the dodge out for the assist. Or just make a one dice block. Without block, that seems garbage. But I guess giving up the score is too bad, isn't it? Gotta make these GFIs first. looking bad isn't it and how this black orc's gonna get clawed that one dice pow really really hammered me that one dice pow without that um obviously i could have blitzed his blitzed his dog with pom now now he's gonna get fouled probably or oh, all gone tits up all gone tits up. Letting the guard player get fouled. The good thing is he's probably not going to surf here now because it's a waste of time to surf here, isn't it? And when the ball's in such a precarious position. Saves his dog. <sighs> and gets another KO. All right. <laughs> Blood Bowl's Mr. Nice. Yeah, I know you're the real Mr. Nice, um, Scooter. <laughs> in terms of... In terms of the guy, in terms of the criminal, Mr. Nice. But, um, but yeah, I want to be a nice guy. So this is looking bad now, isn't it? Really bad. Both Apple's gone on turn two. Um, and he's he's going to run around for the two dice with another more claw. Brutal. Balls of steel. It's all about winning, Jellio. It's not about it's not about saving your saving your Apo for like turn hundred and eight. <laughs> Is it? It's about winning. You play to win the game. So I, I hey, at least he's used his rerolls. He's got to reroll that, hasn't he? I've used both apples. He's used two rerolls. Yeah, he could push him there if he wanted. Yeah. This is where he cases this guy now, doesn't he? After both apples are done. No, just another KO. Three KOs in two turns. Seems seems reasonable. <laughs> right. That's going to block him first. Push. I just can't even get an assist anywhere, can I? I could one dice him. And then... There's just nothing. Nothing I can do.
Just have to hit this. Hit this doggy. Blitz. Blitz this piece of shit. Don't even knock him over. Oh dear. I mean, I dodge him away, but he can't really do anything anyway, can he? Um, double GFI foul. I think I've already lost this game. Just on the old... I guess it's keeping him occupied. Wow. Thank you, Grindel. Have a safe flight. <laughs> yep, see ya, cheers. This is looking bad now. Really bad. Being outguarded by Necro is pretty bad. Blodge versus no tackle is pretty bad. Both rerolls gone. It, this was unbelievable getting getting this guy out. I'm getting that guy out, so I should be I should be doing better than I am. I mean, I would be, I would have lost if I hadn't used the apples. I mean, that's um, that's the thing, isn't it? My if I hadn't used my apples, I would have just already lost. I would have already lost the game if I hadn't used the apples. Whereas now, I might still lose the game. I might still lose the apples. Um, like, might still lose loads of players. I might lose the game, but at least there's a chance. If I hadn't used that, it was it was done. It was absolutely done if I hadn't used those apples. So that was okay, I'm doing that. That was better than me rolling a skull here and, and going to assist this or something. Yeah, of course he's going to blitz him. And of course he gets the pal. Hey! Oh, that's good play, isn't it? He's stranding the pommel. He did that a couple of times. Little bastard ghoul. The funny thing is, of course, he's made his position infinitely worse by going for this. Silly boy. Silly boy. He, he just stayed where he was. And I couldn't have cleared him off and done stuff. But now I can save the reroll even. Which is. Yeah, great. I push just what we need. It just seems so bad, this game. Why does this game seem to be going so badly? I don't understand. I think it's just the, the used up... The used up apples are making it feel a lot worse than it is. This is a pretty good spot for him, actually, isn't it? Because it stops the fre that well, not stops the frenzy trap. It creates a frenzy trap. I guess he's got to stand up. He's got a GFI in. Got to re-roll if I fail this now. So it's it's not the end of the world night now, is it? Those, I think those apples have. Um, no, I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up a doppy a pod, a pod. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not giving up. It's just uh, it's just hard, isn't it? It's pretty hard. Um, it felt harder. It's just the apples are gone. That's the that's the big thing, isn't it? Um, yeah, maybe he could have dodged to mark the goal. But um, I didn't want to leave. I didn't want to free him up. Hey, his third reroll's gone with this this blockless wolf. So that's good. Oof. 
four turns. I might have to dodge away. One in nine to lose the game. Yeah, he's out of reroll. And actually, aren't only down one player. He's down two. It's just not. It just. It just feels bad because. Um, it just feels bad because of the fucking. No, oh, that was a big one dice. So. He's made two crucial one dice piles. Um, it just feels worse because the apple, both apples being gone in two turns, isn't it? That's the thing. But if I hadn't used them, I'd have been done right now. Oh wow, three one dice blocks, all powers. How's it fall? <laughs> yeah. Right, stand him up. Let's take him away from the uh, sideline now. So this is a good situation, isn't it? His his flesh golem completely irrelevantized. Oh, that's not really a word. Irrelevantized. Oh, brilliant. Just what we need. <laughs> On the turn. On the turn, where a dodge with a ball carrier is essential. Roll a double skull first. Wow. So I guess I, I just can't dodge with a carrier now. I have to GFI to blitz with him and then block with him. As horrible as this is, dodging with a carrier now is 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 a, is an insta lose if I fail. At least there's a shot if I fail the GFI here. And there was an animation, so he's failed, hasn't he? Yes. Whew. Okay, so it worked out quite lucky then, uh, making that double skull. Um, he's got a dodge out, aren't he? But then he's not. So I can't. I don't want to risk the uh, one in nine here. I think. I think it's better to not risk this now. Yeah, massive, massive. Wolf's down. No, is that right, Blin? But yeah, dog out is good, isn't it? Even though it, even though it drained all of his rerolls, that dog. And there's still enough time, isn't there? See, because I'm dodging him out is all well and good. But, um... He can't hit the ball, can he? Because if he dodged out, it would be one dice. Oh, he's just going to the the block there. But now I could chain him away, can't I, if I power him? Big if, though, of course. But a power here saves the day. It would have been over had I not used both apples, I think, as a 10. I think it would have been 100% over had I not used both apples. Um, but luckily... Luckily, I was fantastic and had used both apples. <laughs> right. So, yeah, obviously have to blitz here. And get a pal. No pal. This is really annoying. Um, okay, just hurt this guy, please. 
Literally can't pile on because I need him to be based, don't I? Right, so now I've got I've got to dodge out, gotta get over halfway. Yeah. I wasn't going to score if I didn't do it, did I? Fuck. Well, it wouldn't have been a potato. I'd have been in, in, in a, almost a cage. Could have powered him and then wouldn't have had to make the dodge. Maybe I should have re-rolled the dice to get the power. It's a 30% shot, isn't it? I think I had to make that dodge there. I think I have to re-roll it, because if I get here, it's not easy for them to 2D me, and then obviously I'm in range to, um, to score. Yeah, the, the killer's in with a shot, isn't he, of scoring? Thanks to not piling on. Two blodge guard ghouls is horrific, especially when you've got no tackle. <laughs> Minus strength on a failed dog, that would be pretty good. Thank you, turd polisher. <laughs> to what a block here, blitz here, pick up and off score. Right, he's got two turns left. What can happen here? He has to block him and push him to here. Then he doesn't have to block him, but I want to obviously. Then he blocks him. Right, so this one's the most important one because this has to be a knockdown, basically. So now he can go the pick up, right? So now we've got to make this one. He could one dice blitz, I guess. I want a t I want a two dice. Him, don't I? Good. Good. Um. So him staying where he is, he doesn't stop him scoring, he doesn't stop him going back. This doesn't achieve anything either though. So he just goes there and does a 4 plus handoff. Or he blitzes. He's got a blitz out, hasn't he? And then he's a canoring threat. Let's go. Maybe I should have gone for the pick up and then hand off so at least I have a tackle zone on it if I failed it. Thank you for the follow, Trudy. Yeah. Just needed just needed a power there. And then he could have blitzed there, couldn't he? And then it would have all been all been alright. But at least I didn't use my wizard anyway. That, that was something. And if this guy stays out... Um, if this guy stays out and this guy comes back... Got an advantage for the second half. Yeah, sure, Kurgold, but the failure state was better, wasn't it? I would have had a tackle zone on the ball. But then I guess not necessarily, because I could have... The ball could have bounced there, there, and he could have caught it. 
Oh, is he not in range? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI. He wasn't in range, so I should have definitely double marked this ghoul, because now this ghoul can just go. Oh shit, it's not even hard. It's not even hard, I should have moved him in there. Because now it's just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pass. Score. It'll probably happen. Yeah, I think I should have probably just put in, double him, put him in for the double mark. That once I decided I was going to go for this blitz and then pick up and pass, I should have, uh, I should have double marked him. Yeah, of course this is all going to work. Oh, should have made an additional dodge instead of a GFI. More fool him. Um, <laughs> hello, Ilbeard. <laughs> yes, VIP Ilbeard. Hi, roll it, Ilbeard. We need a name for you. Seeing as you're the, seeing as you're the top. The top guy, Ilbeard. We need a name for you if you, if you, if you want some terminology. <laughs> Cause, can it? Viva. Viva. Via. Via. Very <laughs> VVIP, yeah, maybe. The most important VIP of all. Um, I could 3D him, couldn't I? He's better than 2Ding. Um, with Claw. Pom. He's still in range of a touchdown as well. This guy is also in range of a touchdown. Hmm. So maybe I should think about covering the ball rather than blitzing. King VIP. <laughs> right. This just doesn't seem very good, does it? it? Doesn't seem very fucking good. I feel like I should um just cover the ball as much as possible. Got a pow. Can you believe? Don't want to foul the dog without a reserve. Try to get a cheeky Kaz. Got him. Niggled. Fuck you. Um, and of course, when I say fuck you, I mean fuck you. The player. This little shithead, Marcus Pozmiatnik, is the guy who I'm saying fuck you to, not the coach that I'm playing, of course. That would be absurdly unfriendly. And uh, that is not me. Right, so just cover the ball there. Hopefully good. Yeah, he could score. He could score. But um, he had two scoring threats, so if I, put, if I put people in, I couldn't really get people around to mark this guy. I could have 3D'd him, but then that would have left the um, werewolf open to pick up the ball and pass. So, um, the cheeky Kaz was great, wasn't it? Go for this cheeky Kaz. <laughs> Not even your dog thinks you're VIP. <laughs> oh, that's harsh. No, VIPs, VIPs are the way forward, Ilbeard. Especially on Discord as well. We've got the Discord now. And uh, and then got the got that. Um, oh, <laughs> Jimmy sarcastic. It's certainly more realistic than Jimmy fantastic. I just left him there, Auto Twenty Seven, because I didn't want to get blitzed for a random cast. Oh god, three Kaz is amazing. So now even... Oh. Oh no, god, they came back. Yes! Yes! Epic. An orc downfield? No. No, uh, no way. There wasn't one downfield. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's got nine players. Oh god, that's amazing. Is it nine, three, four, five, six, seven... Eight, nine, nine players. 
Right, so um, obviously we'll take the old worthless scumbags on the front line route. Two best Blackhawks in the middle. Carders, important people. I can't believe I've made the second half with 11 players. Um, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. God, imagine if that. Imagine if that guy had stayed out and he only had eight players. It's still scary though. He still got. He still got three guards. Still out guards this. Got you know some strength. Got claw, and he's he. But he has lost his sure hands. But he still got a bludger to carry. But I still got the wizard to turn him over. So, just thank God I used the the apples and those two KOs. I think I'd have been one nil down. Game game lost if, uh, and then obviously that'd have been two more KO rolls to make as well. <laughs> Axe body spray. <laughs> Yeah, Jimmy Sarcastic's good. Oh, he had a, he had a babe though, didn't he? Um, you're all the five, good. At least he didn't. At least he didn't get an unfair advantage from that. But I got an unfair advantage from the uh, thing. Is he going for the quick score? Or just a crazy blitz. Don't know. Boxes. <laughs> P. Diddy. Ah, oh, shit. It's a shame he's got guard. Especially as this guy can block and follow, can't he? Um, but maybe not. Um, fuck, I, I can't say goodbye for a minute 30, sorry. <laughs> um, I might get served here, might not. If he can't block him... But he could block him. But it's still just a one dice. He could block him. But can't because of the other things. I think this is okay, actually. This seems quite reasonable. He's obviously there for the, for the frenzy. <laughs> Mr. Nice averaging one F bomb every 3.5 minutes down from the historical 2.7 milliseconds. Yeah, right. I think this looks okay to because he's he doesn't he's you know he can two dice him, but then he can't, and then he could two, but he can't because of him. And then he could block him, but he can't because of him. He could have to block him, and then things get a little bit tricky, don't they? Maybe I could have him here as well. No, I can't, obviously. Derps of Derpington. Right, that looks good enough. And I shall be right back.
Oh, yes. 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 Oh, my God. One in 81. Living the dream. And, I mean, that was always the risk, wasn't it, that he was going to get into this situation by being able to jam the line like this. Um... Oh, God, pretty exciting. I want to blitz him with my pommer, don't I? So I guess block him there. Pom says... Fuck you, hopefully. Yes! <laughs> I don't even care if he regens because he's out, isn't he? And that's good. Um... Ah, oh, fuck. I've got to use reroll there. This guard guy. Might as well come in here. It's got to follow, haven't it? Oh my god, KO. Oh my god, Rattan is satisfied. What a switch around. What a fucking switch around, eh? Go for the pow, might as well. Got him. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god, what a turn! What a fucking turn! Holy shit! Holy fucking shit! <laughs> Wowee! I can't believe it. This is what happens when you're nice, yeah. Oh, if I'd known this, I would have been, I would have been nice forever. You just stand there as a safety, I guess. Holy shit! <laughs> it's just his team's gone in one turn. <laughs> Fucking hell! Pro tip, kill everyone, yeah. 1 in 81, followed by his entire, entire team dying. Yeah, Lupak's dad. Must be. Fucking hell. Yeah, there might be. He hasn't got the, the thing is he hasn't got the apples, has he? So, yeah. I was thinking maybe I should have gone around there to, to stop him somehow. But, I mean, how does he protect the ball? With a bolt and the agility 4 guy there. This this side completely collapsed. <laughs> the Orcs have a problem. There's no one left here. <laughs> wow, it's crazy. Yeah, he'd never need to put eight men on the LOS. But I got very lucky with a perfect defense, didn't I? But yeah, sure, he could have gone for more. He could have gone for more. Um, what's it called? Um, he could have gone for a more cautious or something conservative offense. Sure, he could have done, but um, you obviously wouldn't expect the perfect defense, would you? No one expects the per no one expects the perfect defense. So he's clearly going to try and go for some kind of um, punt. So want blitzers. In good positions to recover. Pretty much everywhere now. He can go there. Might as well block him and double skull or double skull donor. Not the end of the world. Let's 
Stand hier. Ja. Deal, but it's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, perfect defense is pretty ruinous. Yeah, with um, no who to thunk it is a is a thing, isn't it? Just a saying. Um, the Necro team end. <laughs> yeah, it was it was just one turn. He won in eighty one. Which led to two KOs and a Kaz the next turn, which a uh, oh, perfect defense. Perfect defense. Guard locked him a little bit. Couldn't couldn't fully guard lock him. But did a bit of a guard lock. A so, soft guard lock on him. And then um it was game over. It's not game over, obviously. But um It's about as close to game over as you can get without it being game over, isn't it, I think? He's making a fight of it, sure, but. Maybe I got these guys a little bit too far back because I thought he would have tried to uh, punt it. I'm clearly just going to bolt him now. Mm -hmm. Yep, standard. Um, right, if he can power him. No, of course not. So now, if he gets a cheeky knockdown here, of course not. <laughs> um. Oh, really? <laughs> Double skulls there. Okay, got him. Got him. Wow. Back to working for the man. Oh, good luck. Thank you very much, Ilveard. Right. So a GFI to punch him there. How bad is that? How bad is that? Still got two guys back. He can base him. The thing is, if I push him here, you see, obviously if I GFI to, for the hit, rather than blitzing with him, um, I could obviously just assist and then blitz him on two dice. But if I GFI and get a push, then he can come in and make it a, another two die. And seeing as he's got, and it would leave him in a, more of a pickle, wouldn't it? This failing isn't as bad as that failing, I guess. So do this one first. That limits his options. More if this fails now, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I wasn't expecting the double skull. So <laughs> a one on the a one on the lightning bolt, then double skull on the two D on the ball. Holy shit. Um Wow. I oh, he even gets a GFI oh god he gets to punch him. I shouldn't have um I shouldn't have left them so far away I guess but I still thought he was going to punt but I guess he's not now because he's got a bludger so why would he punt it doesn't make any sense does it Always expect double skull 
<laughs> right, so now I might be able to get three dice on him. Um, one, two, three, four. Need to get him down. Good. Also could pu push him into a three dice. Two dice him into a three dice. That seems like something I'd like to do. Forbidden, it says on the first one. Second one. PM me them, Shawnee, because I can't fucking click them from uh, this thing here. I should have moved one more square with him, shouldn't I? But never mind. Have to go there so I can still move the carrier through. Nice. Oh my god. Oh, the dice. The dice in this game. Crazy. Because first half... The craziest thing about the dice was in the first half, if I hadn't used both of my apples on KOs, I would have just lost. I would have straight up lost. Isn't that crazy? And now, he's completely fucked. What a crazy, crazy match. Go for the foul there to protect the uh, ball carrier. Blackhawk TD on no balls, not when it's nil-nil. Not when it's nil-nil. Nah, he's just staying down. Absolutely standard agility, agility uh, for Orc there. There won't be a turn 16 um, to worry about for rocks. Um, so I guess I'd rather keep my best player to be able to deal with any potential threat. For now, let's foul the fuck out of this flesh golem. That's crazy. What a crazy, crazy match. I can't believe it. I just can't believe it. Because his his three KOs in the first two turns, if I hadn't had that apple, or maybe like, you know, maybe if I'd got the, um, hello RNG god. Um, this is, this is what, this game here is why I prefer the apple to the, um, babes, you know, because babes are all well and good. But if he had made those two KOs there, and I'd been down in nine players, he would have scored in my drive, 100%. 100% he would have scored in my drive. And then I would have had four KO rolls to um, make coming back, wouldn't it? Which is just... You know. Bad. He didn't protect the ball, um, well, yeah, he, he shouldn't have put everyone on the line, yeah, exactly. He, he, he was a bit crazy putting everyone on the line the way he did. Um, there was no need to do that. Um, but once he had done that, he couldn't really protect the ball, could he? Because he, um, he had committed to doing basically a crazy thing. Right, 
no one can affect the play this turn, but still might as well make a cheeky foul. <laughs> Yep, the look can certainly change. Yes, of course it can. I mean, I, I don't give up. I don't give up, but, um, you know, that was crazy. What a crazy swing of luck. I mean, it's, it's insane, isn't it? The first three turns. Um, a good claw set up. I don't really know, to be honest. Um, what a douchebag foul. Thanks, Shawnee. <laughs> <laughs> Some would say it was a douchebag foul. Yeah, maybe. Maybe that's what I need to do. Maybe I need to never, never make bad fouls. Naughty boy fouls. I forgot that I've got a Pommer here who needs his skills. Of course. This is exactly why Yoshi doesn't like me, is it? Is this why? An asshole foul. I'm never gonna stop doing that. <laughs> never. <laughs> never ever gonna stop asshole fouls. Yeah, true. No, this guy knows what he's doing, doesn't he? Obviously. Um, he just got incredibly unlucky. Yeah, I, I do know that. <laughs> I do know that, Jelly Hill, as soon as I did it. I was like, oh shit, I should have counted how many squares this was. Um, but there you go. Oh uh, yeah, the mutation, the reason McManus 1889 said he could have clawed one by one is because werewolves start with claw. Um... They don't need a mutation to get it, they just start with claw and frenzy. So they are they are really good. Um and he 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 hammered me at first, but then in the end I should have said GG, fuck. Too late. Um Yeah, he played he played he played pretty well the first half, it seemed But then he did get those three kills in the first two turns, which thank god I used the apple. Thank god I had that extra apple and used them both as well. A lot of people might have got um, just one babe or two babes. I, I also spent the extra 30k of my own money to get the uh, apple there. And then used them used them straight away. Two, both apples gone the first two turns was was horrific, wasn't it? It was really scary. But then luckily his, his dice cooled off and mine got on fucking fire. Unbelievable. I did outblock him in the end. Um, and more on. But you'd expect more on breaks, really, wouldn't you? Except he's got claw. So maybe you wouldn't expect more armor breaks. But um I did have a pommer. Look a nerd. Go see what your wife do. <laughs> right. Um oh a double. Alright then, dodge. Thank you very much. Agility four, blodger. Um There you go. This here is why I don't like throwers. Because now on his next skill, he's got sure hands and he's, you know, there you go. Yeah, it's, it is intimidating, W Moore 1982. It is, it is a great game, a really, really great game. But it's definitely, um, it's definitely tough to, um, a double one foul. <laughs> yeah, he's the hero we need right now. Um, God, obviously. It's a great game. It's, it's my favourite game. The, I think it's the greatest game ever. Um, ah, thank you very much. Thank you very much, McManus 1889. Um, that's that's what I want. You know, I wanna I wanna help people who are new. I fucking love Blood Bowl, and I, I that's that's what I don't like about this Reddit thing. You know, people saying I'm an asshole because I don't want people to think I'm an asshole. I want um, I do want people to get into it and you know be a be a force for good, as it were. And, uh, you know, if people think I'm an asshole, it's not so good, is it? Um, so, right, I'll have a tea and a wee. Oh, shit. Um, there you go, that was game... What was it? What was... The, I don't even know this team anymore. Game 13. Thank you for watching it. If you liked it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.